A new video now of a very scary scene in Plantation as a man tries to ram his car right into a gas station. Good evening, I'm Jim Barry. And I'm Naja Sherman. Tonight we know what was behind the incident. It was caught on camera. CBS News Miami's Joan Murray has the details. She's live in Lauderhill with what she learned. Joan. Well, this is where it ended in front of this house off of Northwest 31st Avenue, but it really began about an hour before at a gas station in Plantation. It starts with a desperate plea of a woman at a gas station on Broward Boulevard. The middle of the night, the woman is trying to escape her boyfriend who's at the door. The clerk goes to check. Then from surveillance, you see what happens next. The man goes to his car, starts driving, nearly hits a customer, and plows into the gas station door. Inside, here's what you hear. The clerk helps the woman hide in a storage area, and she phones police. As plantation police swarm the gas station, the man takes off in his car and heads east, ending up off Northwest 31st Avenue in Lauder Hill, where residents are jolted awake. It was like four to five gunshots going off, sound like a war zone. According to plantation police, the man tried to grab an officer's gun and was shot. I was woken up out my sleep by one of my children. He said, mommy, mommy, somebody got shot. Across from the shooting, this woman said the violence was haunting. Traumatized, to be honest. I've never witnessed anything that close. Back at the gas station, hours after the commotion, a crew is seen cleaning up the glass and metal and replacing the mangled door. The frightening events on everyone's mind and captured in real time. Now, at last check, the man who was shot was reported in critical condition. He's facing a slew of charges, including aggravated battery on a law enforcement officer and eluding police, as well as kidnapping. Thankfully, the woman was not hurt, neither was the clerk. In Lauderhill tonight, Joan Murray, CBS News, Miami.